This is Western Mass News. An emotional morning in Springfield, a courtroom as the family of a Springfield librarian hit and killed while out walking across State Street in 2021, watched as the driver changed his plea to guilty. Welcome everyone to Western Mass News at 6 on this Monday. I'm Chris Pisano. And I'm Abby Carnavalli. Western Mass News reporter Glenn Kittle joins us live in Springfield with more on what happened at today's hearing. Glenn, we're also hearing from the victim's husband. Yeah, Chris, Abby, Gail Ball's family, as well as her husband, sat in attendance in the courtroom today as the driver charged with killing her pled guilty. That is the scheduled court hearing that was supposed to happen today. It was supposed to go to a trial. There's no amount of penalty that is ever going to replace the loss that has happened here today. Um, it is absolutely and utterly heartbreaking. Moments after Damien Benoit changed his plea to guilty on Monday in the death of Springfield librarian Gail Ball, who was struck and killed while crossing State Street in November of 2021, hoping to avoid prison and allow him to join the Marines. The judge in the case had a decision to make, and it was a large part based on video he viewed of the crash. That video shows conduct that is um, concerning to this court. Speeding down State Street at that time of the night, um, in a heavily uh, heavy pedestrian area, crosswalk or no crosswalk. Gail Ball's husband, George Miller, also spoke before the court, delivering a heartfelt statement calling for the maximum sentence possible to be delivered to Benoit. That negligence and the deadly act that it produced have brought us here to today's proceeding. When I have to face the realization of a truth that I've lived with every day for the past two years, one month and one day. Taking all of this into consideration, Benoit was given the maximum prison sentence of two and a half years suspended after six months, plus three years of probation and a 15 year driver's license suspension. Western Mass News caught up with Miller shortly after the hearing ended. He tells Western Mass News he's still not satisfied with the outcome. We have to just kind of roll with the punches um, as far as that goes um, and know that, uh, um, you know, that that some measure of justice for Gail, you know, has been done. Benoit's sentence will begin on January 3rd. Now, coming up later tonight, Miller shares his thoughts on road safety measures and what more needs to be done in the wake of his wife's death. Reporting live in Springfield, Glenn Kittle for Western Mass News.